Hi everyone, do you remember who I am? <laughs> I am so happy to be back filming and I will it's nothing's going to be permanent and yet I've been sporadic enjoying family and uh, just doing things around for the summer uh, I can explain that in a later video but I just want to say hi and I it's perfect for filming coming back I am going to show you guys the new red apple lipstick colors that they are releasing is four new colors one is a re-release uh renamed and so i do have my notes i'll go into detail and let you guys know the formulas and the colors from what i know so far the sale starts tomorrow friday the 19th and i just want to show you guys swatches i figure why not i have been using this since november of 2014 is when i found them i own almost every color that has been launched the one re-release is the one i did not get new name same formula but i love that and i'll get a little bit more into detail with that but uh yeah let's go ahead and get started i have my trusty little wipes here and we're gonna try the best that we can and <laughs> swatch properly for you guys i will swatch them on the back of my hand as well but I, this is, it's like filming all new again, so <laughs> bear with me. I will say again, if you have stuck with me and continue to subscribe, thank you so much for doing that. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you for checking out my channel, and I hope that you will subscribe if you like the content of videos maybe that you've already watched or this one. But uh, let's go ahead and just show you guys... Um, I'm just going to kind of chat as I try these on and let you guys know. Uh, they are re-releasing uh, one color and it is red 101 now it's red apple lipstick it's i guess their signature color uh there are five lipsticks in all uh, i'm looking at my notes here there's let's flamingo there's kiss me there is day after morocco and also the uh, last color is oh snap dragon and they do have an eyeshadow that's called oh snap so i think it's kind of cool that they uh kind of added that uh dragon part to their previous name uh, i don't know if the color that's one of the things maybe an upcoming video i'll do that how close is that color to the actual eyeshadow uh these are nut free formulas except for the red and uh like i said they will launch tomorrow they're having a launch party that starts at 6 p.m. Uh, if you're following me on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook I will make sure that I put that information there as well and then I will probably update this video to let you guys know that the more information that I find they have released uh, what the ingredients are in the lipsticks and I will try to put that down below as well or it will be on one of my social media pages and um, the uh, red apple lipstick red that is in uh the original formula there's two in the insta color formula which is at my absolute favorite formula of theirs it is a staining formula so you put it on it goes on very smooth uh very creamy it dries down not to a matte it is a very comfortable wearable lip color but it leaves a stain so it is one of those things where i put it on in the beginning of the day and then by the end of the day then it's just like a stain and i only have to use their rally bomb which is their lip balm to just kind of touch that up and the color stays fresh pretty much all day long it does not have that really weird wear that wears down leaves a line around or um, leaves a color in the middle it's just a perfect smooth color so let's try on I don't have my glasses here um let me grab those hold on one moment I did just have them on my bed I could have grabbed them there but oh well so anyway uh the first color let's pick which is I'm going to put that on my hand first to show you guys what this color looks like it is a beautiful color they have not released um, or stated what the color actually looks like it is a pink none of these have shimmer or shine to uh, you know like uh, micro glitter or anything like that so you don't have to worry about that it is just a nice creamy formula in a I would say a medium pink but uh, we'll go ahead and put this on this is in the insta color formula so this is going to leave a stain and stay on your lips there is no scent to these they all are scent free except for the red and it is also nut free um if you guys have stuck with me you know that gluten free is my first priority that is why i originally found them and started purchasing them and uh so then it was dairy intolerance which i don't have to worry about that in their lipsticks and then some nuts have given me issues almond is one of them that's the red apple red has almond in it so i'm going to kind of see how that works and i am going to try that on and i'll get back to you guys and just let you know if i have any issue but uh i'm gonna go ahead and try this on i would say this is like a bubble gum or barbie pink uh if you guys have watched me for a while you know 
that I am 46 and I do not I do not think this is a color that is not wearable for someone of my age. It's a little <laughs> out of, I think it's a little cool tone. The only cool tone color that they actually list is uh, the uh, Oh Snapdragon is on the cool tone. Everything else they describe as a warm tone. But to me, this seems like a cool tone, maybe because I have golden um, undertone to my skin. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. But this is the color Let's Flamingo. The next color that we have is Kiss Me is described as your perfect pink red balance as a satin color. It is full coverage. I think they're going to be all full colors, especially the instant color formula. That is just naturally going to be a full color. Uh, this is their new silky formula. So I really cannot tell you guys about this one yet. It but this is uh, one of the two lipsticks in their new formula. They said that it's supposed to be uh, like the Instant Color. It's excellent pigmentation, long lasting color, just like the Instant Color formulas. It still leaves a stain. It's not matte, but smooth. And I would say this is, I mean, this is a nice color. Let's Flamingo is the first one I tried, which is the Instant Color formula. So I don't know if you guys can see the different in pigmentation. And this is Instant Color, but I'd say a lighter color. And this is really nice. I. I like this but we'll try this one on Got a little outside the lip line there uh, they also describe this again this is in the silky series the new formula it's a wear you can wear this bold which I don't think this is too bold. Love this color. This is a gorgeous color. Uh, you, they say you can tone it down to a medium rose, but I already think on my lip tone, this is already a medium rose to me. I, and just, I don't know. <laughs> there are no scents. Again, this is the Nut Free. Uh, the new Silky series has the Nut Free formula. And I am looking off to, uh, if you see me looking off to the side, I am looking at a mirror. But let me know what you guys think. This is uh, Kiss Me. Very, very pretty color. <laughs> this may be my new favorite color, guys. I love this. Wow. Mm. It kind of, it is very comfortable. Wow. I don't know how to describe this new formula, but I almost don't want to take it off. It's, it's, it's smooth. It's creamy. It's, it's, wow. <laughs> Instant color has always been my favorite formula but wow okay all right i know i gotta try them on so i gotta take this off guys okay moving on to the next color is let's do day after morocco and i will swatch this so you guys can see the color this is described as a medium red pink coral beige undertones they said to picture a desert rose in a terracotta pot or a little bit of an orange pinky tint it's the instant color formula no scent nut free so, wow, I'm still, guys, these colors are my favorite. This is a very neutral, everyday color. Um, it has a, To me, again, it's... My lips in the summer when I get a tan tend to turn a more of a purple. So, for me, I'm thinking this is more of a beige, very neutral color. Um, yeah, almost like a almost a nude but they do describe it as a coral beige undertone so to me this is definitely in a uh, nude category and it could be someone's perfect your lips but better color so <laughs> wow mm. so that's the two uh, we have two in the instant color formula so moving on and I'm hoping you guys are able to see the swatches and my lip colors pretty well if not let me know. I'll post it again for you. I can always do that for you guys. And this is a lilac color. Okay, I'm going to say Bite Beauty had a color like this that I actually got rid of. And I'm not sure if it's in a, I think it's a declutter video, and I was trying to replace this. Oh my god, this is such a gorgeous lilac color. It's not one, I'm just going to say not one I'd wear every day, but it's a fun color. It is described as a lilac pink. This is the one they describe as a cool tone. And it's in this new Silky Series formula. No scent, nut free. 
And I should mention that uh, they describe the Silky Series formula between a satin and the instant color. The instant color, I do know it's creamy when you put it on, but it, it does dry down and it does leave a stain. And you're not going to have any of that creaminess left behind. I think the Silky formula is going to actually be a little more long lasting. I can't say for sure. This is just in first impression what I think. Um, don't want to forget to swatch this for you guys. So this is the color on the swatch and in the bullet. Oh man. <laughs> I am digging all these colors. I say this every single time. And I don't, Melissa be quiet, just show me your lips. I say this every time. I don't think red apple lipstick can outdo themselves and they outdo themselves every single time they have a re a launch for their lipsticks and these are four gorgeous colors wow wow i am just oh this is i love this it is a gorgeous lilac let me oh look at that color man that is gorgeous i just these are colors like nothing else now with that being said i want to say i own a lot of red apple lipstick lipsticks and i the reason i love this company I bought a lot, almost all my lipsticks, I mean, um, same thing with the eyeshadows. I owned almost every single Red Apple lipstick shadow before I became an affiliate with them. And I could put up my glasses until um, I try on the next color. So I was in love with them, their formulas, their oh, the pigmentation, their product. They were gluten-free to my sensitive standards that I needed. I love that they had different formulas that were nut-free and it was just an amazing company. And that's why I'm so behind them. So um, just if you guys are for wanting to know about that and how I found them, uh, that's a little bit of detail. But I just want to say they did send me these colors, but uh, I would not promote anything I did not stand behind. And this company is one that I fully stand behind. I love it. Uh, I love that it's a small company. They stand behind their products. They have a six month uh, guarantee. So if you have any issue, you just email one of the girls there, one there, and they will take care of you. So let's go ahead with the last red apple lipstick color, which is red. This was formerly red 101. So this is a re-release. And I'm going to swatch this sit underneath the pinks. This color I was waiting for, I was so happy to see that they were re-releasing this. I, July 4th, we went to a lot of events, uh, family gatherings, and I didn't have a good red color. Out of all the colors that I own from Red Apple Lipstick, they don't have one that is like a true red. I think this is more of a blue red, blue true red. So everything I have has a brown undertone or a pink undertone. Now this one I wish I had... I'm going to say a brush, and I didn't bring one out, so I'm going to be a little careful. Hold on a minute, guys. You need a little bit more precision to, to do those. All right, let's see how this works. Okay, I'm going to show you guys the swatch again, and this is the color in the bullet. I love this color. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous red. It is a uh, neutral, true red, no shimmer. It's, um, d this is the only one that has a scent, natural vanilla smell. It's in their original formula, but this does contain almond oil. So if you have an allergy to nuts, this one may be a heads up for you guys. But, um, oh, this one's smooth. It almost seems a little bit more slippery, so. This is one that at my age, I don't really have any lines around my lips, but I definitely could clean it up if I had a lip uh, liner or a lip brush. It's gorgeous. I love this red. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm really glad they released this color. And this isn't a color that I'm going to wear every day, but I don't know. You really should have a signature red though, right? <laughs> so, oh, I can't. Yeah. Okay. Can you tell I really am in love with these? 
So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, thank you so much for checking out my video. Again, the sale starts tomorrow, Friday, f July 19th, and they do have a launch party starting at 6 uh, p.m. Make sure that you check out Instagram, my Twitter account, and also Facebook, and everything's linked down below so you guys can check that out. And uh, I will fill that information in as I get it and also be posting on my other social media formats besides YouTube where you're watching this. So hope that you're all having a very happy, healthy, and gluten-free day, and I will see you guys hopefully very soon in my next video. Bye, guys. Take care.